why there is zero, zero value in playing back the full case prompt to the interviewer after the interviewer gave you the full case prompt. So this is a classic, right? A real classic because many candidates and applicants are, are doing that and they are just wasting time because there is just zero value playing back the full case prompt uh, to the interviewer after it was laid out to you. Um, first of all, the interviewer has seen this or like has given this case prompt already a couple of hundred times in many instances. So they are very well aware of what is in there. And second, you will not be evaluated by your skill to listen and note down the things the interviewer told you. What you should do instead is making sure to use that opportunity to ask questions in terms of was there something unclear to you, right? Was there something maybe that you haven't heard? Was uh, the, the question you should solve not clear for you? Um, because here, what you should do instead and where you have a real opportunity is to restate the client's question to make sure to, that the interviewer is confirming on how you would like to approach that question. So what actually is the question you would like to answer? You have the, the one and only opportunity in the case to naturally ask back that question to the interviewer straight after the case prompt was given. So in case the question is not crystal clear to you, use that opportunity, restate that question in the way you would answer it and get alignment with the interviewer. So there is a lot of value add if you do that. Um, and also, as I said, make sure you're completely uh, clear on what was said. There is no need to play it all back, right? But if there is something unclear to you, just quickly ask that and then co really continue and ask the remaining questions that are necessary in order for you to get started, for example, on the client's objective um, and also or potential quantifications of it and also um, timelines and, and business model. Um, and uh, yeah, just, just make sure to also not ask too many questions here. The rule of thumb needs to be, can you provide an answer to the interviewer? If the interviewer would ask you, why would you need to have this information at this point in time? And if your answer is actually out of curiosity, <laughs> It's not a good answer, right? Because many information that might or might not be relevant, um, you don't need at the beginning to structure the problem um, at hand on how you will approach it in order uh, to solve it for the client. But you can also ask these questions later on if they get relevant based on the discussion you're having with the interviewer, right? So please don't play back the full case from to the interviewer there is zero value in doing that and um, yeah, just don't do it. <laughs>